Hey, it's Jared with Gear and Light. I'm in the hangar of Angle of Attack. Chris Palmer is a flight instructor and has a school here in Homer, Alaska. I am a student pilot and I came up here to spend a little bit of time with him, fly around Homer, Alaska, get a little bit of education of my own. And of course, he's a friend of mine, so spend some time with him. We worked on his studio here, which you can see a uh, 2-3 uniform right behind me. You can see the cool wall that uh, is over here for part of the studio with the angle of attack sign in the back. Um, we've spent a lot of time just kind of dialing in things here, but the rest of the time we spent in the air. And of course I took cameras with me. Not only uh, while we were flying, I'd take a few moments and shoot some photos, but we visited some cool spots and took some photos as well. And so periodically through this video, I'm gonna show you some photos and just talk about that experience a little bit and uh, some of the things that I've appreciated just shooting up here, because it's not every day that I get to just go out and shoot for pure enjoyment. Uh, a lot of times, you know, we get our photography equipment and we get, a, we get a little bit of knowledge and we start shooting photos for people. We get uh, in the, the zone of just being a photographer and maybe it becomes a professional thing for you. I know for me, a lot of times when I get out my camera, it's to go and accomplish something for somebody else. And I don't necessarily get to do that for myself. And so while I was up here in Alaska, I wanted to take some photos and just enjoy photography for what it is, which is a creative outlet. Uh, and a lot of times I'm creative for other people. And so while I'm up here, it was nice to be able to take some photos. So uh, I have my A1 here, and this is actually Chris's 100 to 400 millimeter G Master lens that uh, I've shot with a bunch up here. I have my lenses, and I've been kind of swapping between them, trying to capture different things. Uh, from the moment that I arrived, you know, we started flying. We were up in the sky taking pictures of beautiful glaciers and snow top covered mountains, and just the fall, uh, the time of fall with the fall colors here is in full swing probably on its way out within the next week or so and so being able to capture those beautiful vibrant colors definitely uh, just it just feels great I mean fall and the colors are probably one of my favorite times of the year uh, you know living in Montana I get to experience that and now getting to experience what that looks like up here in Homer Alaska so on the second day that I was here, we flew uh, just a short flight, about 15 or 20 minutes uh, across the, the bay uh, over to Soldovia and walked around. And it's just a really interesting place. It's, uh, you know, one of the uh, Alaskan villages that is only accessible by plane or by boat. And so as we walked around, just seeing the different things that were over there, taking pictures, enjoying the environment that is not so touched by everything because it's a little bit harder to get there. And it was also a really fun landing and takeoff getting in and out of there. It was a new experience, something that I've never uh, experienced before. So being in a 2-3 uniform right here behind me, which is a Cessna 172, and flying around this area in Alaska has just been absolutely fantastic. So Chris's channel, Angle of Attack, here on YouTube is not not just about aviation education, uh, there's also a lot of really neat things that he gets to do, especially being up here in Homer, Alaska, which is just a beautiful area, uh, halibut fishing capital of the world. And so uh, you might wanna head on over to his channel and see some of the things that he does uh, that's not just education. I mean, if you're interested in learning how to fly, of course, it's probably one of the best YouTube channels on the internet for you to check out, but also just to see from a different perspective from the sky, some of the amazing things that he gets to see and be a part of, because that's one of the great things that aviation does. It can take you to those places, and he does a great job of capturing that. So my time is coming to a close up here in Homer, Alaska. We've taken photos with the A1, several different lenses, my A7C, we've set up cameras, uh, the FX3, We've set up lighting in his studio. We shot a ton of stuff with GoPros on 2-3 uh, uniform here. So videos like the GoPro Hero 9 versus 10, 
We've got an airplane flying over right now, you might be able to hear. So the GoPro Hero 9 versus 10 video will be coming out soon. If maybe you haven't uh, decided whether or not to get the new GoPro Hero 10, I've got some side-by-side -side footage, including footage out the side of 2-3 Uniform as we fly over Homer, Alaska. And uh, probably a couple of other videos too. Uh, definitely a few for State of Tech, which is my other YouTube channel. So if you're interested in mobile tech like iPad minis and stuff like that, head on over and check that out. So I hope you enjoyed some of the photos that I took. Uh, some of them are available on my Unsplash account. So if you want them for a photo background or something like that, you can head on over there. I've got it linked down below. You can download some of those photos and use them for your background wallpaper on your phone or your computer or something like that. But that's gonna do it for this video. Thanks for joining me up here for a few minutes as I showed you some of the photos that I took and talked about a little bit of my experiences up here. If you ever have a chance to come up to Alaska, you definitely gotta to go to Homer. And if you ever wanna go in an airplane and learn how to fly one, you definitely gotta to talk to Chris and subscribe to his channel over at Angle of Attack. But that's gonna do it for this video today. Thanks so much for being here. Give it a thumbs up, click that subscribe button, and I hope to see you back in another one soon. Take care.